hey guys, Wade here. So I'm probably in a different environment than you've normally seen me. I'm set up at my local sporting oval at the moment because I want to test a new bit of kit that's arrived. I'm a firm believer in don't test kit on game day. Test it beforehand. So uh, here it is. Sitting on the front of my car. It's the Powerfilm Max. I think it's about a 28 watt solar panel, but what it actually has is an 18,000 um, milliamp hour battery or uh, 18 amp hours. Um, it comes with a supplied female cigarette socket, which I currently have attached to my radio directly, and it's been delivering about 12.2 volts. Um, I wanted to test it in a real world situation. How long will it run the 817, how, um, charging my phone and things like that as well. My goal is to be able to take this out and do multi-day activations and things like that with this as my primary source. But additionally, I've also got it set up so I can use my balance charger, my LifePo balance charger. It can actually receive uh, 12 volts in from the Max, which I tested last night. But I want to check for RF noise and things like that. I've got my dipole set up along here, along the footpath, so let's see how it goes. So I've been working for about an hour now across the radio, um, actually a little bit more than an hour. Um, the solar has been holding up well, the, the, there's actually virtually no indication that it's gone down maybe one bar or so. Um, this is sort of the station setup, you can see the solar on the car, and it's directly connected to the 817. So here's my uh, LiPo charger, I'll put it on the, um, on the bench here and I'll show you how I use it. Now because I've standardised all my connections to Anderson connectors, I can actually unplug from the solar and plug straight into the um, LiPo, sorry, the Life 4 charger, Life, a LiPo 4 charger, which delivers a balanced charge into my standard SOTA batteries that I use when I'm up on the hill. I've got a smaller one here, just a little Zippy 4200, or I've got the, um, the 40, the big one here, the 42, the 2 pack. So this is the solar, this is the input side. Charges from the wall by USB-C, there's a 12 volt car input, and on the outside there's a female cigarette lighter that's provided, connects straight to the 12 volt connection, two 2.4 amp um, USB out, and there's also a light or torch in there as well. And you can see here that's sort of a comparison on my hand and it rolls up about that big. Getting up a new station, um, so uh, you're on the video, you're the first contact I've had on 15, but uh, basically it's a mini uh, solar setup for the 817, over. Oh, okay. So you're only running five watts at the moment on solar. Uh, well, you're coming through quite close on this band, and uh, yeah, we're receiving you good today. Uh, don't have to struggle with the headphones, over. Yeah, QSL, it's the best I've ever got you. I'm uh, not at my home QTH, I'm actually at a local park and I've got a uh, full uh, dipole up, sorry, uh, yeah, full dipole up from Soda Beam. So the best antenna, quietest location and uh, best time of day, over. From their signal, over. Good afternoon, Paul. You're a uh, ear splitting 5 9 with some uh, plus plus uh, on the peaks. Over, yeah. Good day, Wade. Very good afternoon to you, mate. Hope you're well. Uh, I, I've just been glued to the computer all day and I just needed a break. Came up into the shack and uh, I just saw you spotted there on the, the DX Costa and also Stewie up in Darwin. Obviously, just work your VKA NSB. Uh, he's posted you up on the, on Facebook as well. Uh, so I think you're running five uh, watts, and mate, if you are, we have pretty good signal. You're five and seven with a little bit of QSB, but on the peaks here, you're five and seven, wait. 
Really good signal. VK1 FWBD, VK5 PAS. Yeah, thanks. Uh, thanks uh, for coming back, uh, uh, Paul. That's, yeah, 5 watts. Um, just testing a new solar setup for portable uh, work. Uh, plus some multi-day stuff. It just arrived in the mail yesterday and um, I wanted to set up the dipole and sort of it all came together. Beautiful afternoon, uh, no wind, dipole up and uh, solar out. Over. Well, it's working beautifully, mate. I'm sure you'll get a lot of other calls. You, you're a really good signal here. I'm just looking at the photograph there on, uh, uh, on Facebook. As well. Victor Kilo 2, Foxtrot Sierra Alpha Victor 1. How are you going, Brett? So you're 5-3, five, 5-3, three, five, three, over. Same road, I just saw the post on face, Facebook, mate. You're, you're also 5-3, you're, um, you're, you're, you're doing great for 5 watts, over. Yeah, QSL, thank you. Yeah, just out testing some kit uh, while the afternoon's uh, nice and warm, over. Mate, doing a great job. All right, wait, I'll let you get on with it, mate. Thanks a lot for that, 7-3. 7-3, thank you, VK2. FSAV VK1 FWBD. Alright buddy, 73. 73. CQ, 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 VK1 Foxtrot Whiskey Bravo Delta. VK1 FWBD. Calling and listening. QRZ, any other station standing by for VK1 Foxtrot Whiskey Bravo Delta? I actually got you on the last time, uh, John, but uh, you were... I thought I must have been off the back of the beam, over. Yeah, where is the beam? It's on the dead pieces. I was on my 160 metre dipole. <laughs> A bit inappropriate, don't you think? Well, I'm on the 40 metre dipole, over. Yeah, but that's the classic, that 40 on 50 thing. That's actually supposed to work. <laughs> You're not terribly strong, probably. Uh, not the park that you're thinking. I'm sitting on a cricket ground, over. Oh, okay. Well, still good to make the contact at least anyway. Good to know that everything is working and all that kind of good stuff. Um, I'm actually sitting here listening to 144 decimal 1, which is open to uh, Tassie and VK3 at the moment. So, don't know if you brought any VHF antenna 2817, but uh, interesting times, over. Uh, I've got my roll-up Slim Jim, which I normally stick up halfway up the squid pole. Now that's an idea I can have a play. Um, yeah, I might um, grab that. I actually have only ever made one, so one in 600 contacts on uh, SSB for um, on 140. CQ, 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 VK1, Foxtrot, Whiskey, Bravo, Delta, operating QRP portable, calling and listening. VK1, KW. Good afternoon, uh, VK1, KW, VK1, FWBD, how are you this afternoon? Good afternoon, uh, VK1 uh, FWBD, VK1 KW, my name is Rob, Romeo Oscar Bravo. I uh, wonder if you've been looking at VKlogger.com. Uh, there's a lot of lines between Tasmania and uh, uh, VK4, uh, so it has been open on 2 metres and more so on 6 metres today, of course. But uh, no, you're putting on a reasonable signal here, I'm not sure where you point it. Uh, I bet it's fine somewhere around there. I left you calling for a little while just in case. Uh, Someone else uh, further afield uh, heard you there. Good to catch up, VK1 FWBD, VK1 KW. Yeah, uh, thanks Rob. Um, I actually think you were my very first contact almost 12 months ago on my little HT when I got licensed. Um, I've been up on 15 working um, uh, VK8 and things like that, and I was talking to John VK4 TJ and he said that. Uh, uh, Two, two meter SSB um, started to open up, so I put the Slim Jim halfway up the uh, squid pole 
I'm just over in um, Harrison's uh, soccer or uh, cricket ground, over. Okay, um, I got a phone call. Um, Alright, uh, I'll get back to you, I'll, I'll get that phone call. Yeah, QSL. So it's just before sunset, uh, it's now 7.25 local. And we've been going for, I reckon, probably uh, two hours. Two hours exactly. Two hours exactly. And um, the power film is showing uh, six out of ten on the battery status, which it's been running the 817 at five watts full power uh, for the 817. And I've been calling fairly regularly. I'm a fast caller. Um, as well as having my phone plugged in. It charged my phone from dead to full and uh, it's now plugged into the tablet which is my logging software. So um, I'll give uh, another bit of a look here. This is uh, the, uh, the solar setup. And um, it's, it's actually been dead quiet. I've made contacts this afternoon on 2 meters SSB 15 meters, 40, um, they're the only two bands I've had to play with. But um, yeah, so if you've liked the videos, don't forget to head over to the website, waitabout.com or vk1fwbd, and click on the icon there that buys me a beer. Uh, that'd be really nice. Hope you like the videos, look forward to sharing more.